Cardano bounced off a crucial support level and if that sounds interesting to you, make sure to continue watching this video. Our Telegram channel has been absolutely killing it with these trades. We have made some insane profits. So for those of you that haven't joined yet, make sure to do so if you guys are interested in keeping up with my trades as well as free education. Hey guys, Pinky Charts here. Welcome back to another Cardano analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in free $600 Bitcoin, make sure to check out the link in the bio. As you guys can see from yesterday's moveset, we finally saw that breakdown formation on Cardano breaking below our exponential moving averages as well as the fact that we did see a beautiful retest of our support line here at 0.3472 now this is a perfect example of why i have my lines like this and i have not changed them in years these are very large daily support and resistance zones you can see that cardano came perfectly on that support line and then we saw a very clean bounce opportunity as well as the fact that you can see that we did have a strong pullback opportunity as of right now and for those those of you that are in the telegram we made an absolute killing today so congrats to you guys for taking my trades and following along and of course for those of you that haven't joined make sure to check it out as you guys can see on cardano though right now on the four hour time frames we are testing the exponential moving averages but we could be looking for a nice break above and retesting our previous support at 37 now there are two things that can possibly happen at this level number one of course is we see a clean retest opportunity and a rejection and then a continuation to the the downside or a strong bullish engulfing candle capturing all of these shorts that pretty much entered the market thinking this was a pullback and we start seeing a continuation possibly over to our major resistance here at 39 cents as well as the 41 cent level of course the question is going to be which one is going to play out now i want you guys to understand pay very close attention to seeing the current state at 37 if we do get a break above and we do see a strong continuation that is not an opportunity to be looking for a shorting position some of you guys ask me that okay if we're hitting the exponential moving averages is it always a good idea to look for a short and i do want to mention the fact that once we test an ema line it's usually a no trade zone the reason why is you can see a massive breakout opportunity look for example you can see that here on the nine exponential for cardano as soon as we hit that 36 cent level we saw a massive breakout opportunity and you don't want to get caught out into that position if we look here overall though you can see that yesterday's moveset played out almost perfectly and of course i mentioned that if we see any breakdown formation of this 34 cent support level this would become extremely bearish as long as we remain above this green line we are still looking for long opportunities as well as the fact that even on the hourly time frames you can see that in the bart formation from yesterday played out beautifully we were testing these uh, this very close consolidation level here at 38 cents couldn't see a break above to our major resistance point here at 39 and then we saw a break below the exponential moving averages which was your indication to start looking for shorting opportunities and then we had a massive move going all the way down to our major level here as of right now of course looking at the hourly time frames you can see that we have broken back above the exponential moving averages and this usually is an inverse bart formation so this is why i'm mentioning the fact to pay close attention to this fake out area and see whether or not we can actually break above our main level here at 39 now yesterday i did mention the fact that cardano will be looking to test our nine exponential moving average Average on the daily time frame you can see that we did actually break below the nine as well as retesting that major support but we are still extremely overbought on cardano this is one of those coins that have seen such a large pump opportunity that i mentioned it's going to be very dangerous looking for long-term long positions because we are still waiting for a larger pullback opportunity in my opinion i think the bullish case of course will be ending somewhere around this 44 cent level because of the fact that's pretty much where the move set started so pay very close attention to this very large v-shaped formation that is looking to play out and once we hit that level and if we do see a clean rejection that could be life opportunity for you guys to obviously make a ton of money but that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in free 600 bitcoin make sure to check out the link in the bio and i hope you guys have a wonderful day.